Good afternoon to the citizens of St. Bernard Parish. Today is Monday, May 18th, and another weekend has gone by during this COVID-19 saga here in St. Bernard Parish. As we always do, we will have our daily prayer for those who have lost their lives and their loved ones. Thank you. We will start um, right away and, and go into the numbers uh, from the LDH website. We currently stand at 513 positive cases and 19 deaths here in St. Bernard Parish. But as we get into this, and we've said it many, many times, that 513 um, positive cases, we have to put all of that into perspective. Like we say, the hospital is where we get daily data. That's where things happen first. These tests come in groups, you know, sometimes weeks behind, right? So what, has, what is happening at our hospital over the last week? I believe it's like six days. We haven't had a COVID patient admitted in six days. We haven't had the numbers of uh, they are minimal, if you will, at the emergency room. We were getting, remember, back when we were getting 150 or so visits to the emergency room daily. Now, some of that's due to education. Some of that's due to, you know, more people just aren't as sick anymore. Um, but we're going to find out here in the next two or three weeks. And that's what's so important about this. You know, the, the governor is a military guy and he talks about not having to fight for the same terrain twice. Well, what we're doing right here to put it in perspective is this is kind of a reconnaissance um, deal. We're, we're testing the waters, if you will. We're doing some spying on this COVID-19. We're getting out and we're doing a little bit more. And that's a great thing, you know, but we got to do it in a responsible way. So I'm figuring in about two or three weeks, we're gonna start seeing some activity. And these numbers that we go over every single day, while they are important over the long haul for the marathon that we're in, what we're gonna be looking at here in St. Bernard Parish is what's happening at our hospital and any reports that we get from physicians' offices during this time. We expect to have something happening. We're hoping it's not a peak and we're hoping it's flat and if, and if we do that, we have done our job. While we're getting back to baseball, while we're getting back at the parks, while we're dining in at restaurants. So a lot of things are happening right now. It's all positive. Our people here in St. Bernard Parish are doing great things. We are being so responsible in every neighborhood throughout St. Bernard Parish. And I'm looking forward to being bigger and better when we come at the end of this thing here in St. Bernard Parish. So we're continuing to work with our region. We're continuing to work with our governor. We continue to monitor um, President Trump's um, discussions and his guidelines on what's happening um, in our country. So we are so pleased that most of our businesses are open. We are working hard to get all of our businesses open here in St. Bernard Parish. So thank you to the citizens of St. Bernard Parish for doing what you're doing in a way that is respectful, in a way that is respectful of your neighbors, um, and taking care of yourself and your family members who may be vulnerable. So thank you again. I just want to say before we leave today that progress is still being made in St. Bernard Parish during this COVID-19 um, saga, as I, I, I like to call it. Um, quality of life here in St. Bernard Parish has always been a number one priority of this administration and this council. Um, we are, um, as, as of today, we are demolishing the water treatment plant at the end of Jean Lafitte by the 40 Arpin Canal. That is going to be an extension of our observatory, um, green space, where people today are out there fishing at the 40 Arpin Observatory. So grab your fishing pole, 
grab your child or your grandchild and go out there and catch some bass, go catch some perch, and see what's happening at the end of Jean Lafitte at our old water treatment plant. It is being demolished, and that is going to create such a positive for Buccaneerville North. We believe that is the next area of growth, big growth, um, here in St. Bernard Parish. So thank you to the citizens of St. Bernard Parish, and God bless each and every one of you.